you know why it's called the wattage cottage? Because <laughs> I can tell you what this thing will say. Plenty of wattage in that. <laughs> now, you, do you know why this place is called the wattage cottage? Because it's the hardest quit in the country. The wattage cottage, because even if you're 30th wheel, it's no easy, no easy rest. You hit your biggest numbers. <laughs> biggest numbers for me in two years for sure. So a few weeks ago on this channel, I did a little video on the crits being back here in Melbourne, one of the best criterium scenes in the world. And in that video, we went down to St Kilda Cycling Club, South Melbourne. But I also talked about the other big crit scene on the Sunday here in Melbourne being Glenvale. So that's where I'm going today. But if you just land on this channel, this is where I do cycling videos, both inspirational and entertaining. And I do love a deep dive road bike review. So if that sounds up your alley, consider subscribing below. So, Glenvale versus South Melbourne. Both great races, but vastly different beasts. Glenvale's a little bit more industrial, if you can't tell by the background here. They're both held by different cycling clubs, they're different environments, different types of riders, and Glenvale has this unique characteristic, something that I didn't really note as I was climbing the grades, but more so as I've entered into A grade, and that is a lot of watts are required just to get to the finish line tough out there. So in this video I wanted to share with you what it's like out at Glenvale, but also let's find out why it's called the Wattage Cottage. So what brings you both down here? Oh, our son's in uh, B grade, so yeah, okay. he just comes on the weekends. And, yeah. So this is your first race down in Glenvale? It will be my first race at Glenvale, yeah. yeah, okay. yeah Where have you raced pre previously? Um, down to Kilda a few times. Oh, okay. um, yeah. The Latrobe uh, course as well, the oh, uni okay. course, so that was oh, pretty right. cool. Yeah. So yeah. What, what brought you down to Glenvale? What was the motivation? Uh, a few of my mates do it down here, but the, the course looks really quite attractive, so the big corners and you know some nice straights and things. So. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah, thank you. How about yourself? I uh, really like Glenbow because the atmosphere is really relaxed, um, really easy going crew um, and, uh, and the racing is really good so yeah, high work rate because um, it's, it's, it's relatively flat and, uh, and some good uh, sweeping corners so yeah really enjoy Glenvale. I think, um, I think it's, it's one of the best circuits uh, in, in Melbourne. Nice, yeah. oh, good luck. Thanks. <laughs> so what brings you guys down to Glenvale? I'll just get a flogging on a, a Sunday morning. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just uh, drag Tough myself. Tough out here, is it? Oh, always. Nick, yep. racing today? Yep. Yeah, what are you racing? Uh, sea grade today. Sea grade? What yeah. brings you down to Glenvale? Uh, just the local crit, good place to get out, and there's yeah. a whole lot of strong hitters out here. It's the hardest crit in the country. <laughs> so why is the hardest crit in the country? I think it's just the way the course flows. You yeah. can't really relax too much. Like you're up around the corners, you're down into a fast finish. Um, the wind sort of swirls through the factories. Yeah. So it's just like that, you like oh, absolutely. Yeah, right. Sorts the men out from the boys. <laughs> so I'm going to be sorted out the back. <laughs> what, what brings you down to Glenvale? Oh, good racing. Good yeah. racing? Yeah. What do you like hard. about it? It's hard. You can't just do nothing. Yeah. Great <laughs> yeah. race today. Sea grade. Sea grade. What brings you down to Glenvale? Bit of fun. Bit of adrenaline. 
today? I know, I did Arthur's seat yesterday. Oh, you did Arthur's seat yesterday? Yeah. So you just come down to watch? Yeah, just do a spin. Sneak uh, around or? Struggle, struggle yeah. along. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Good, You're racing today, yeah. Dale? Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, You're gonna, gonna be call it pick? racing. <laughs> oh, yeah. Rolling around. Yeah. What are you doing down here, mate? Just come down and have a bit of a look, mate. Yeah. Church. Mm. You uh, do you remember racing down here? Yes, I do remember making very embarrassing faces <laughs> while I was trying to hang on to all these <laughs> blokes down here. What yeah. was it like racing down here? Hard work. Hard work. Bloody yeah. a lot of hard work. It's called the yeah. it's, just, it's called the Wattage Cottage for a reason, isn't it? He'll be back. <laughs> How'd you go there, mate? First one back uh, for a while? First first ride for a long time. Yeah. Came in fresh. Yeah. Um, a lot of beers over the uh, of the beers. spring spring period. A lot, of, sport, a lot of sports sticks. <laughs> <laughs> apparently sports sticks aren't that good for you apparently. Yeah, good to get out there though. It was very good to get out there actually. Yeah. I loved it. Yeah. yeah. Good to be back. What's going on with this black kit, Patrick? Just a new team, mate. Eh? New team? Yeah, I don't want to let down the white kit. Yeah. They're all good riders, so <laughs> I'll roll around in the black one and yeah. have a bit so of fun. What's your goal today? Um, oh, it's just nice to be racing and yeah. haven't been riding too much, so good to be racing with the boys and just watch what they're doing and give them any feedback that I can. Do you know why it's called the Wattage Cottage here? Yeah, it's always a good hard race here, so it should be fun. It's tough to get around here. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think you probably, if you race on other circuits, um, and you compare what you have to produce to get around in the grades, yeah. you probably find that um, it's probably a bit tougher here. Are you going to get a workout today? Are you racing? No, Marshall C next. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, yeah I now. haven't been doing uh, any riding all winter or during the week of late. So I'll stop just go for a jog a few days a week. A jog? So, yeah. <laughs> I'll start um I'll start now that we have sand down doing a ride on a Tuesday night. Okay. Helping out with some marshalling there. But yeah, yeah, not enough to um I could probably get around but it would be uh, a bit too much pain. <laughs> Um, it's like first 10 minutes or something, it's just like full on and then gas were appearing and yeah, they split up in and long time to be away, yeah, brutal. Who were you with? Um, we had Carter Turnbull, Raph, uh, Bentley for a while there, um, then we had Pat Patterson, oh, I'm rooted. Yeah. So, well done, mate. Cheers. Good on you, man. Very happy for you. you. You got your food or something last week, no? Yeah. How'd you go? Hung, hung in there. Hung in there. Hung in there. No one so. can talk after an A grade Phoenix one. Everyone's something up their words. Yeah, they just don't let up here, do they? So, yeah, yeah Rob so the like Phoenix boys. Yeah. yeah. Yep. So. Yeah, you used to rob the Phoenix boys, didn't you? I still He's do. Got, oh, you still do? Today. Oh, you're just a hybrid. Yeah. <laughs> you guys that? Oh. With, well, it was 20 minutes ago. I was like. Uh, I set up now, sit up, but. Oh, you're putting a bit hard. for the boys. 
us. It's not about winning here. <laughs> it's about staying away. That's all. If you come in the end first, second, or third, is. Yeah. <laughs> they say it's tough down at Glenvale. The current leader of the national road series, the highest level of road cycling in Australia, down at Glenvale. Also, where did you come in the German nationals? Eight. Eight last year. Two years ago. So the boy can ride. Oh, as a leader of the national road series. What's coming up? Yeah. There's only one tour left, two of Tasmania. Starts yeah. on the 14th of November. Yeah. So I'm just preparing for the last one. Yeah. And there's always good heat out here, the local criteriums, and yeah. everyone is super keen just to have a super intense race. So no one really, you know, of course you want to stay away, but it's not not too much tactics like in, in higher races. Yeah. So it's always a really tough day out. Keep so Yeah. A couple of the Cos boys. How you How going, mate? Today? Yeah, no, good. Yeah? Good day. It was uh, a lot better today. It's uh, no no brake checking today, so it was good in the lower road. So. Made a few friends with a couple of guys and so, uh, got a lead out and uh, came away with a sprint to the end, so it was good. Yeah, once. So. Oh, shit. Congratulations. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Doing Cos proud. How about yeah. yourself? How was your ride? Yeah, it was pretty, pretty full on, so I went early with a few of the boys, the informed guys, and um, that got pulled in and they got pulled in and then they bounced off again straight off the front. and. They had a solid run out the front and uh, we couldn't couldn't bring them back. I think we got three out the front there and we just caught them in the end at the bunch. But bunch finish for me. Yeah. Big cooked at the end and tough. Yeah. Seagrate? Seagrate? Yeah, yeah. How do you find the racing down here? Yeah, good, good. This is the second time I've raced and uh, I really enjoy it. Uh, I finished third. Yeah. yeah, it wasn't too bad, pretty solid. Pretty I thought solid. it was gonna, we were going to be in trouble first up, but then we uh, brought it back, started rolling. Yeah, it was a good race in the end. So you lads race today? Yes, we yeah, did. Yeah. yeah, we did. How'd, how'd you go? You go first. Oh, I finished in B grade, it was okay. Yeah. It was quite fast at the beginning, but then uh, settled halfway. What do you like about racing out of Glenvale? Oh, I just love the circuits. So the circuit. nice, smooth, sweeping, it's challenging. Yeah, it's, it's a really nice place to race. Do you know why it's called the Wattage Cottage? Well, I, don't, I guess just because you need a lot of it to, <laughs> <laughs> to get it. I thought it was because of me. <laughs> I think it was you about me. Think it's of think, you, yeah, yeah, it's about me, isn't it? It's all about me. So you're the Wattage Cottage. It's about yeah, I started the Wattage Cottage. Okay. Did no, you? no, I didn't no, no way. <laughs> no. How did you find the racing then? No, it was great. Yeah? No, no, B grade was great. I mean, um it was you know, it was it's probably as good as some some A grades in other in other quiz circuits around the country. Yeah. You know, it's they're the, the speed of B grade and, and the quality, it's just getting improving all the time. Yeah. So, no, it's great. It's great racing, you know. I mean, I've raced A grade most of my career. So, um, yeah, you know, I've got a, I've got a good hand on what A grade is. And, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Pop the chest the, out there on the, the Carnegie. The... Everyone, this is the Honey Badger and he's got the swagger from hell. He's a bachelor if I've ever seen it. Have a look at him. <laughs> Cal Douglas, he barracks from Melbourne. He's a good man and he's got some swagger. Good on you, mate. And the winner today, we discussed him a couple of weeks ago, he's the key position fella, but he needs a bit more meat on those bones. Tommy Benton, right on Tom. Great stuff, Tommy. Well, come here, big man. About three laps to go, mate. Your legs, your head was bobbing down a bit more than your legs. You, you feel a little bit of um, yeah. discomfort? Yeah, pretty boxed in those last few laps. It was a long, long time to be away, but yeah, we got there in the end, so that's all that matters. Just give all our volunteers and that a round of applause and the riders. And we look forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks. Thank you. Okay, so that is it for another Sunday. Glenvale is done. Just a couple of things to wrap up this video. First of all, thanks to all the volunteers out at Glenvale, Caulfield Carnegie Cycling Club, for putting on Sunday crit racing for us all. Second of all, just to summarize, Great people out of Glenvale, awesome track and tough racing. You've got multiple NRS teams, lots of NRS riders, and big names, Raf Reinstein, Pat Lane, and it's tough racing. So for me, I'm gonna go pick up both my kids who are being looked after so I could go thrash myself at Glenvale, I'm gonna have a shower, I'm gonna sit on the couch, feel fatigued, and think about what I could have done differently at Glenvale today. I'll catch you in the next video.